Welcome to our data visualization tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many ggplot users encounter. Our viewer is trying to create a graph using geom point range, but they're facing an issue with overlapping groups. Let's dive into the details of their question and see how we can help them achieve a clearer visualization. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy just like me and hopefully you get through that resolution. So let's continue on. To address the issue of overlapping groups in your ggplot graph, let's first understand the use of position dodge. This function helps to separate the points for different groups along the x-axis. In your original code, you used position dodge with a width of four. This is likely too wide, causing the groups to overlap. Let's adjust the width to a smaller value. Here's how you can modify your code. Change the position dodge width to 0.5. This will create enough space between the groups without excessive separation. After making this change, run your code again. You should see that the points for groups A and B are now clearly separated, improving the readability of your graph. If you still experience issues, consider checking your data structure or adjusting the dodge width further. Experimenting with these parameters can help achieve the desired visual effect. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The user has figured out how to use position dodge with geom point range. They recommend using position core dodge 2 with a width of 1 for lines. And that's it guys. I hope the video helped find that resolution you were looking for. And, you know, if it did, please, I appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until next time, guys, that you need more technical help, I hope you have the good one. Cheers.